What were the milestones in the seven years you spent working at Diamond Consulting and what led you to pursue other opportunities? So there's really those uh, various steps of consulting. If you want to generalize, there's being able to do the work, being able to lead the work, lead a team, sell the work. And it took me a couple of years to graduate from each one of those steps and it really was an amazing transition. It was as if I was at a new company or I had a new job. To be able to crank out models or presentations used to be really, really stressful. And they were hard. How'd you, how'd you manage that stress? Again, it just goes back to my childhood, understanding what's a big deal and what's a small deal. If you can make it through those other things, what's the big deal with a client, you know, just yelling a little bit or your partner yelling at you a little bit. You have to manage them. If you show them this is your plan, this is how you're gonna execute it, they have to believe in you, you have to execute. But as soon as I knew how to do those, I wanted the new step and the new step was able to lead that work by myself or a section. And after I did that, it was about leading a team and interacting with the client. There's nothing more valuable than getting the growth of leading a team, interacting with the client, having to manage that situation, knowing what's a big fire, what's a small fire. This is when we're getting into real entrepreneurial work, being able to manage those situations. So there's definitely a lot of learnings that happened.